some reason my stream turned off, so I casted all of that literally talking to myself. That's really embarrassing, all that talking and shit I did. I just did it to myself. Oh man, that's that's embarrassing. Ooh, Foggy trying to use the staff, but he got bashed from the Taskmaster. Actually, cancels the staff. I think he wanted the staff in to focus his base, try to get some cancels done. Meanwhile, focus is at tier two. He's getting a spirit lodge, getting a bestiary. Now I'm really paranoid that OBS is gonna turn off on its own again. I really don't know why I did that. That's really weird. I keep <laughs> I, t I commented the early game literally to no one. Oh well, we're here now. All right, but yeah, Foggy not able to get any cancels on the tier two, so no delays coming in. Focus should be getting into a pretty nice mid game here. He's gonna try to kill the Quill Beast, get it a little more experience. Blade Master is about a little over halfway to level three. Foggy's gonna creep. Meanwhile, Foggy taking the tier three, double Ancients of win. No surprise here. Getting his talent add up training for the Storm Crow form, but you really don't see it. He wants mastery for, of course, his. Cyclones, but one of illusion not a bad item And focus already with two berserkers. He keeps buying them from this merc camp I do believe and like I said earlier when the stream was off berserkers do really good damage to talons as towns are unarmed units Of course, so you know they take extra damage versus piercing so you can't go wrong with some berserkers There we got the demon hunter right clicks foggy does have boots of speed So he is Players able to keep up with the blade master very easily get some damage off meanwhile He's continuing to creep with his beast master even using a wand here nice use soaking up a lot of damage from these creeps And the TC it's also at level 2 so he has shockwave. It's only level 1 though, so it doesn't get too crazy Level 3 is definitely the magic number for the Tarn chieftain and we should see some walkers coming in as snare for the raiders. Walkers still not at adept, so usually orcs get like one walker and then go for the adept, but he goes for two. I mean, the longer walkers are out, the more mana they regen, as they do not come out with full mana. Shockwave gonna hit one of the talons here. Nice talons, getting some moonwall juice, and right now it's 43 versus 31. Cyclone getting one of the talons. The other one's really low here, but at the same time, Focus losing a grunt. He doesn't want to poke in too far in that night out base, although Foggy is pretty much out of Moonwell Juice here. He's going to have to rely on the healing potions from his shop. Whisk coming in, in. Whisk coming in to dispel the uh, Spirit Link. Stream still up? It is still up. I'm really paranoid OBS is going to turn off on its own again. Anyways, Foggy trying to make a hold here, and I kind of like this timing. Even using the Wands of Illusion to try to block up that Beastmaster did not work, of course. But I give Focus an A for effort, even getting a Moonwall. And that oh, it does not supply cap Foggy here. He's getting more talents. His Mastery training is only about halfway done. And Focus pulling some peons for Spirit Links, I would think. He has no War Mill, so no towers. This isn't going to be some weird tower push. And that's another Moonwall down. This one will supply supply cap Foggy. He's at 29 out of 30 supply here. But Focus does have to back off. His Blade Master is getting pretty low. He's going to have to get some time here to get some heal salves. This gives Foggy some breathing room. He already has another Moonwall being constructed. He'd be calling the Ancient of War back to defend. Are under attack. But I like this timing out of focus. He got this some damage done. He knew Foggy was low on talents. He knew his mastery training wasn't finished. But the timing seems to have stopped. The mastery training is finished. So far he only has five talents though. That's not a good chunk. His moon wells are still extremely empty. Even having to use a moonstone here. And there's the Tinker third. Pocket factory is very nice. Adds a nice little melee line here. And of course, the little AOE damage they do when their life has run out, ran out, run out, whatever the proper English is. But we got a snare on the Demon Hunter. Focus trying to go for the focus. He isn't using an Inbom pot here, so he does get Cyclone. And Foggy using an Inbom pot as well. His Moonwells are still extremely low here. 
He's got one with juice all the way over here. I'm not sure if that'd be in range. Maybe if he's here, he can use it. But focus, continuing the pressure here. Very nice. Foggy only can get up to 40 supply. Focus is already at 49. And he's about to kill the only Moonwell with juice. And this will supply cap Foggy yet again. More Cyclones going down onto the blade. Tarn Chieftain's starting to get a little low, though. But I like this. Focus is continuing to keep Foggy supply capped. And he can't get that good chunk of towns out. And now the Beastmaster forced to use the TP here. And this is just looking really good for Focus right now. But Foggy's not going to give up without a fight. Another ensnare. Got double crits. And the Demon Hunter getting lower and lower. And GG is going to be called. And Focus takes game number one in this best of three. Well played out of Focus.